Hi everybody, hope you're all okay today. Today I've got a video that's a project pan video. Um, so I don't know what video is going to be going up first. You may have heard this explanation before. I do apologise. I just don't know what order I'm putting things in. And if I look a little bit harassed, I am. <laughs> I've got lots to film today because I'm trying to get back uh, on track after like Christmas and New Year, my little girl's birthday, my daughter and my partner being off, things like that. Um, so yeah, um, I've decided to join along with some project pans uh, just because we have that many products. I certainly do with that. I just, I end up not using in the go off and things like that. So I just want to be a little bit more focused and trying to use things up. Uh, so this one today is 22 for 22. So there are my items. So you choose 22 products and you try and use them up during 2022. So I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> what kind of products are supposed to be I think they are supposed to be makeup but some are doing like a mixture um, of like body care and skincare and things like that I thought I was going to do that but then when I raided my makeup I I probably could have done this twice just with makeup um, so yeah um, the plan is to use everything up um, obviously there's no pressure um, it's just about seeing if you actually like things and um, decluttering what you don't and um, be more aware of what you do have so you're not repurchasing the same items over and over again I am a monkey for that if I see an eyeshadow palette I'm like oh, those colours are amazing I buy it I get home and I realise I've got about 10 palettes that have the same shades in the same shimmers everything like that so I'm just trying to be a little bit more mindful um, and some of these have been in like mystery bags and things like that uh, but the majority is what I have purchased uh, some have been uh, like gifts we purchased and a couple of bean farm subscription boxes so if I keep looking down I'm just referring to my notes as we go along but I have weighed everything out um, just so I know where we are I'll try and do monthly updates either with a new way or just how I'm enjoying the products how I think I'm getting along things like that just to keep you all updated on what is going on so our first item is the Catrice HD liquid coverage foundation this is stunning it's one of my favorites I absolutely love it it's really cheap it's about seven pounds uh, you can get it off the just my look website it is amazing um, but this weighed in at 114 grams and um, the other day when I weighed them I am uh, I explained them the video I just recorded um, I am a couple of days behind so I did weigh these at the start of the year but because I've had to wait to actually film they have had a couple of uses since uh, but nothing major uh, but yeah that's our first item the next item is the Body Sharp uh, matte lipstick and it's Nairobi Camilla um, the shade um, this is gorgeous um, I've had it quite a while it's been open a fair bit I don't think there's much in it um, so I'm pretty sure this will get used up but this weighed in at 16 grams next we have Avon uh, magics and this is the prep and set spray so this is probably just over halfway full and maybe like two-thirds something like that Um, I've only just recently discovered this and I absolutely love it. I've got another one on the way. Uh, it's 109 grams that it weighed in at. Um, I shouldn't really be saying I've got others on the way because that's just not what we're supposed to be doing. But <laughs> yeah, um, I do do really, really like it. Next up, we have Downton Paris Liquid Blush. And this weighed in at 15 grams. Uh, I don't think it'll pick up with the ring light, but it's down to about there. Um, I've actually got it on today. I really, really like it. Um, so yeah, once get that one used up, with it being a liquid blush, they don't last forever, do they? Until they start going hard and a bit weird. Uh, so yeah, I just want to get that used up and enjoy it. Next up, we have an Elf liquid eyeshadow, and this is in the shade Disco Queen. It's like a silver um, glitter. And this weighed in at 20 gram. Um, same as the lipstick and the blush. And I just want to use them up before um, they 
like go out of date and dry up and things like that um, so they've been open a, f a few months now uh, so I'm just wanting to to enjoy all of the product and the next one is Elf liquid eyeshadow again but this one is in ocean eyes and this weighed in at 21 grams next up we have the body shop insta glow and this weighs in at 34 grams next up we have an elf lip oil and this weighs in at 35 grams this was um in one of the vegan goodie bags to give with like a gift with purchase sometimes and i do really really like it Next up we have Catrice True Skin Concealer, this weighs in at 32 grams, this is my go-to, I absolutely adore this one. Next up we have Ico Lash Alert Mascara and this weighed in at 10 grams. This is one I've only just opened a couple of weeks ago, um, but I just wanted to include it just to encourage me to, <laughs> to use it. Next up we have Revolution 5D Lash and this weighed in at 24 grams. This one is probably nearly out, uh, which is another reason I put the Ico one in as well. Um, but yeah, definitely get that one cleared in the year. Next up we have Elf Poreless Putty Primer and this weighs in at 35 grams. This one is very nearly out. Um, so that one I can definitely get out. And now I've got the Illamask uh, Hydro Veil in my other project, but this I use like around my nose and just onto my cheeks where my pores are a little bit bigger and I go in with the more hydrating primers on the rest of my face. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty confident on that one. Next up we've got Nose uh, Laguna Bronzer. This weighs in at 15 grams. This was just a mini we got in one of the boxes. I've already hit pan on it. Um, so yeah, I'm just wanting to get that one used up. Next up we've got Essence Make Me Brows. This weighs in at 9 grams. Love this one. It's like a coloured brow gel and it's got like the fibres in as well like the benefit one really really nice now i am going to be doing a project with eyeshadow palettes to involve every palette in my collection but this one is um a sleek one and it's color camouflage one two eight seven i kind of just want this out of my collection if i'm honest um it's not that old uh but it just constantly gets um hard pan so I just thought I'd put it in and then if I, during my other projects, if I get an eyeshadow palette that's all shimmers or I just need a darker shade uh, for the crease or something like that, I can dip into this one. Um, I'm very close to just decluttering it if I'm honest. So uh, this is kind of just it, its last chance really um, to to make sure I really don't like it before it goes. Next up we have my Code Beauty uh, uh, blush and this is six grams. Um, it's just a much brighter pink than I normally wear. Um, I tend to go more for peaches or red tones, uh, like true reds, like I've got on today. Uh, this is quite like a hot pink and um, so I'm just trying to force myself to get a little bit more use out of it because it's not that I dislike it when it's on my skin and um, I I just don't reach for it so I thought I'll put it in this project and it'll make me use it a bit more and have some different looks sometimes. Next up we have Laura Mercier lipstick in fresh and this is waning at 10 grams so it's only a mini um, but there's that much product so I think that's quite doable um, I've got this on under the um, by Terry lip gloss today um, it's a beautiful shade next up we have Catrice full satin lipstick in full of baldness and this is 25 grams this one is very nearly out um, so very confident I will get that one used because it is my go-to if I'm wearing a mask this one doesn't sm uh, smudge so um, yeah, I'm using that one a lot at the moment. Next up, we've got Ju Yu Liquid Highlighter. This weighs in at 31 grams. I think it's like Josephine or something. I'm not sure um, of the 
brand. Um, I can't see it anywhere. Uh, I think we got it in the glossy box a few months ago. Uh, but it is really pretty. But again, it's a liquid product, so it needs using. Um, so just want to get a bit more use out of it. Next up, we have Revolution Conceal and Define Foundation. This weighs in at 116 pounds. This one is getting to the bottom. Um, so I just thought I'd have two foundations that are both like <laughs> nearly nearly done um just so we can make sure they they are used up um but yeah i i do really like this one i prefer the catrice one uh, but this one is also really nice next up we've got a catrice um lip liner and this is the, the plumping lip liner and this weighs it in at four grams i love these again like the lipsticks i know they won't smudge uh they won't um the cover mascara there's quite a lot of product uh, product in there but it's quite a versatile shade that i can use with a lot of things so i still think i will be able to get that used up and our last product i don't think there'll be any surprises it's the she glam uh two in one brow pen this weighs in at nine grams so we've got like a retractable pencil that side I'm saying retractable, I hope it is, <laughs> I've not actually tried, so we've got that much product on that side and then just like a fine nib felt tip on the other. Uh, this is one of my favourite brow products at the moment, I absolutely love it. Yeah, so that's my 22 for 22. Um, I saw this project over on Lady Mara's page. I will link her down below. She's absolutely gorgeous. Please go and give her a watch and a like and subscribe. She's she's so lovely. Um, but she gave all the details, uh, the sign-up sheets, things like that. Anything I can find for that, I will put down below as well as Lady Mara's page. Um, I'll put them down there too. So let me know down below what you think. If you th do you think I'm going to succeed on this one and get all, all of those products used up? If you're going to be joining in, please let me know. Um, you can do it either signing up properly. It's free to do everything like that. Um, or you can just do it yourself and just pick up some products you're wanting to use up and just, just do it at home as a little project for yourself. Um, please let me know what you choose, what you're using up, how you're getting on. Don't forget to like and subscribe and if you hit that notification bell, it'll just let you know every time that I upload it. And as always, thank you for joining me. Enjoy your day. Bye.